March is Women's History Month, and on Let's Talk Nonprofits, we will hear from a Shiro who uses arm knitting to provide campaigning and donations for nonprofits. Coming up. Tell me about any challenges. I know when we hear about designing, sometimes you automatically think about women, but there's another side to that. And as women who are doing so many great things, have you ever met any challenges in your career field, whether in the nonprofit side or designing, as a woman trying to make the, your career our own and grow? I have, actually. And most of it more is on a personal side. Um, you know, having getting the respect of being an educated woman in a field, because um, mainly, although I focus on interiors, most of my work is done with architects. Well, the architect is uh, mainly a male-dominated field. I also work with real estate brokers, and mm. most of them are men as well. And so, um, gaining the respect of the knowledge that I bring to the table has been a challenge. Um, always uh, so and to we draw have to walk the fine line of being empathized empathizing with our physicians that we work with and the space that we're designing but also satisfying a client who may be a real estate broker and who is trying to make a deal so that is always an interesting um, dynamic that we um, balance when we're working on our jobs especially at VK. Do you feel like it is improving or progressing? Um, you know, I think that's one of the nice things, um, as we call it V-Cave, it's Bean and Doll Cave. Um, we really, we are mainly, I think 85% of our employees are women. And our designers are so versed in um, the codes and regulations that we have to follow to get spaces built. And so they're the women in my firm are such strong, educated, um, powerful women, and I think that we, we thrive off each other. And so I think we, we are an anomaly, I think, in, in mm. our uh, industry because of that. And so um, I I, we have gained the respect of the real estate com community through that knowledge and, uh, that we bring to the table. That's amazing. You are definitely a shero. Sometimes I don't know how you do all that you're doing. I also know that something you didn't mention is that you're also a writer, an author. Well, <laughs> uh, on the side. <laughs> so I, you know, uh, a couple of my friends, one of my friends who actually lives in New York now, years ago before I moved to Atlanta, gave me a journal. And she told me, and I'm not much of a journalist, or, you know, or a writer for that matter. And she's like, you are going to write a book one day about um, your dating experiences. So I've been working <laughs> on that slowly. Um, I did a couple of years ago to start a um, blog focused on design. Um, work has taken most of my time for that. But I'm, I'm, still, I'm still dedicated to, you know, one of these days. I'm going to be at Chelsea Handel slash Elizabeth Gilbert. <laughs> <laughs>